Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Welcome to the South Side Scoop. I'm Katie Chris, And I'm Tyler Argot Singer. Today is April 10th and it is a purple day. So I saw Twitter was updated yeah, by Park Hill South. There is a lot of tweets on Twitter and I think Brandon has more on that. Thanks Katie and Tyler. Today on Twitter we have tweets from at Park Hill South Counseling talking to anyone who wants to be a teacher. The future teacher workshop is drawing closer. The deadline is getting closer day by day. As on May 1st you will no longer be able to sign up. Now, from future teachers to some extraordinary teachers. The Pride winners were announced last week. Congratulations to all of our winners. Now back to you guys at the news desk. Now we're going to have a short break with the news continuing after this ad. down we look back on some of the biggest moments as a major part of any Park Hill South school year is the athletics the athletes that play these sports are often left with fond memories and for some it's even the highlight of the year uh, my favorite moment by the school year was probably doing sports you know just like being on varsity soccer as a sophomore that was probably my greatest moment of this year from all the major memories to the major achievements, both girls and boys basketball won districts. A highlight for the Park Hill South Athletics. Uh, I'm glad that they won districts, but kind of sucks that they didn't make it to state. But it wasn't just sports here at Park Hill South. Whether it was drumline, or jazzy cappuccino night, or snow days that will collude with the board meetings, it has been a truly packed year from point A to point B. No, not really. It's been kind of long. Like all those uh, four week break, or like four weeks, like four day weeks was nice, and then after that, it's kind of been kind of long. Perhaps the biggest takeaway from the year for most Park Hill South students was the increasing amount of snow days. Park Hill South had 10 snow days, leading to a modified schedule that was put in place at the end of the year. Uh, I liked all the snow days that we had. The days for this Park Hill South school year are nearly numbered. Whether you enjoyed it or not, everyone has a highlight to the year. I'm Lou Kicks and Peyton Haverman signing off for the Southside Scoop. What's now? Cap and gowns will be delivered to seniors tomorrow during lunch. It is recommended to try on the cap and gown to avoid any last minute problems with the fit. If you have not ordered your cap and gown, please contact Jostin to 816-523-4900. If you still have a balance on your Jostens order and have not picked up your items, please see the sales rep at this time. Picking up your gowns or turning in forms. Seniors, we are still accepting senior community service forms. You may turn yours into attendance until Friday, April 12th for an admitted if absence. If you plan on attending prom, tickets will be available during lunch periods on April 22nd through the 24th. Ticket prices are $45 each. There will be no after prom this year. 
New to the Scoop, this Saturday on April 13th, the Spring Fling will be from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. at Gurner. Seven students are needed to assist preschoolers with carnival games and activities. These are the only weekend hours available this semester for A+. On today's lunch menu, we have popcorn chicken with hot roll, man-eating meatballs, and the premium meal is Bosco breadstick with marinara sauce. That's all we have here on the Southside Scoop. I'm Katie Chris, And I'm Tyler Argutsinger. Have a wonderful Wednesday, Park Hill South.